Just be calm when things are going well, be calm. Don't think you're on top of the world in the sense you always got to be wary because I've seen it. I've seen people come. I've seen people go. I've seen them come. I've seen them go. You got to be chill. You got to like just take what's good in your life and move forward cautiously and carefully. And thank God that you have that. Just it's very, very important not to, to overextend yourself when you're when you think you you know you got to there's no such thing everybody's dispensable yo 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 what up youtube welcome to cn take man my name is jay cn coming back with another one and as y'all can see we coming live from the rose garden man take a look at it take a look at it man we got another beautiful day out here we still going strong so y'all already know i gotta thank the most high for waking me up this morning and giving me another opportunity to be great. And I want to send a big shout out to my brother and my ancestors that's up there. Looking out for your boy. I love y'all. I love y'all. Look at this sky, man. We ain't got one of these in a minute. You know what I mean? We ain't got one of these in a minute. But either way, we in it. You know what I'm saying? Backdrop check. Backdrop check. Y'all know where we at. You know? Still going strong in this rose garden, you know? But man, yo, I just wanted y'all to see that clip from Robert De Niro, man. Shout out to Robert De Niro, you know, keeping it 100 there, man. Because listen, you know, you definitely got to take advantage of when you up. You know what I'm saying? When you up, take advantage of that. You know what I'm saying? But you got to stay calm at the same time. Stay humble at the same time, man. Because you don't know how long that's going to last. So it's just like he said, don't overextend yourself. Don't think that, you know, just because you up, it's just gonna stay that way. You know, a lot of people, they mind, you know, go into that space where it's just gonna stay like that. It's a wrap, it's over, I'm, I'm in it, I'm this, you know, I'm this, I'm that. And you know, you know, they, they come tumbling down quick, you know, because they thought that they didn't have to put in no more work. You know what I'm saying? They thought that everything was just a given. You know what I'm saying? And they didn't take full advantage of the opportunity that they had. You know, so, you know, the passion left, the work ethic left, you know, the drive left. You know what I'm saying? The gratitude left, you know what I mean? You know, they didn't. They stopped involving the most high in it. You know what I'm saying? And they thought they could just do it all on their own. And they let that pride in it. You know what I'm saying? They thought that they could keep going without the most high in it. And they let, listen, bruh. You know, they let that pride in it, bruh. <laughs> they let that pride in it, man. And when they came, when it all came tumbling down, bruh, you know, they didn't know how to get back up. You know, some people can still make it for after that because you learn a valuable lesson. But some people don't, man. Some people don't come, they, they never make it back to, you know, that status where they was at because, you know, they lost themselves in that. And it's, it's usually a sad case, man. You know, because you've seen the potential in a lot of people, you know what I'm saying? You know, you've seen the talent, you've seen the glow. You know what I mean? You've seen that work ethic, you heard that, that, that hunger. You know what I'm saying? You heard that hunger, you know, but, you know, they let their ego just take over. They let that pride take over. You know what I'm saying? And they didn't stay calm in that situation. You know what I'm saying? They didn't take advantage of that opportunity. They let that arrogance get in there. They let them demons in their ear. They let them women. They let them women, them women, them women hype their head up. You know what I'm saying? And it's just like, yo, you know, it's unfortunate, man. But you can't, you know, let that be you out here, man. You know, when you up, take full advantage of it. Stay calm. You know, keep it steady, you know, stay in your process. You know what I mean? And keep working hard, bruh. Because that ain't it. That's not it, bruh. You know what I'm saying? You know, the only time you got a ceiling is the one that you put there. The only time you got a limit is the one that you put there. You know? And that be what stop a lot of people too. They just say they put their limit. You know, they set their own limit, not knowing how far they could have took it. They set their own limit, not knowing how many levels that they could have went up. You know what I'm saying? But, and it's just, man, 
you know, we can't be doing that while we on this journey. We can't be doing that while we elevating out here. You know what I'm saying? And letting things get to our head just because we making way, letting things get to our head just because we getting good results, just because we let things get to our head, just because we getting these blessings, just because we got the glow, you know, because we know like, listen, man, we have our ups and downs in this. And that's exactly why I tell you to embrace both, embrace the ups and the downs. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, we know it ain't forever that we gonna be up. You know what I'm saying? Do the you know, circumstances due to all types of things, man. You know, we know, you know, we ain't always, you know, high energy like that. You know, mugs would be a lot if they say just because they on semen retention. You know what I mean? Just because they own no fat. You know what I'm saying? Just because they had a spiritual awakening, just because they may be a chosen one, that they don't have their ups and downs. That's a lot. You know what I'm saying? Just because they those things and they just, they energy always up. That's a lot, bruh. That's a lie, bro. We go through more things now, you know what I'm saying, than we did back when we was lost, to be honest with you. You know what I'm saying? Because we got to maintain this, you know? So it's a good thing, you know what I mean? We not in a dark place. And, you know, we, we, we more up for the adversity. See, back there, we ran from the adversity, you know? Back there, we leaned on the world. Back there, we leaned on drugs and alcohol. We leaned on sex. We leaned on porn. You know, but now it's like somebody just, you know, it's like when you was getting ready to sit down, when you was getting ready to take steps backwards, you know what I'm saying? When you was getting ready to slack, you know, when you was getting ready to do all that, it's like somebody removed that chair from under us. Now we don't have those things to lean on. So that's why I say we go through more things now than we did back there. But back there, we wasn't getting strong. We getting stronger here. We getting stronger through the adversity. We getting stronger through the resistance. We getting stronger through these problems and situations, the ups and downs, the positive, the negative, bro. We be like this out this motherfucker. But guess what? We still here. You know what I'm saying? We still here on this roller coaster ride. We still praising the most high on this roller coaster ride. You know what I'm saying? We still walking with the Hamashiach on this roller coaster ride, bro. You know what I'm saying? We ain't letting pride get in the way. We ain't letting them demons get in the way. We ain't letting ego get in the way. Arrogance get in the way. Women get in the way. Drugs, alcohol get in the way. We ain't letting none of that get in the way. You know what I'm saying? So, listen, bro. We gonna, we gonna persevere through anything, man. You know what I'm saying? We gonna, we in it for the long haul. Not that short shit. Like I said earlier, bro. A lot of us just being, you know, they want that short stuff, bro. We thinking long term. You know what I'm saying? We thinking long distance. We know that this is a marathon. Shout out to Nipsey. You know what I'm saying? We know that this is a marathon. You know, but you got to be up to run it. You know what I'm saying? In the marathon, when you when you got it already in your head and you know that it's a marathon, listen, you might you might fall back a little bit. It might be some people that get in front of you. You know what I'm saying? But guess what, bro? That don't mean that you can't catch up. You know what I'm saying? You might stumble a little bit. That don't mean you can't get up and keep going. You know what I'm saying? It's a marathon. What you thought? Mugs, mugs thinking this way. What you thought we was running a 40-yard dash? Nah, no, this ain't the 40, bruh. This ain't the 40, bruh. Y'all running the 40 out here. And that's exactly why y'all moving too fast. And then you're falling on your head. You know? Because you're trying to too busy trying to chase after the world. You're too busy trying to chase after these girls. You too busy trying to have a status, like trying to get some type of status out here. You know what I'm saying? You too busy looking at how everybody else living and trying to catch up to their lifestyle instead of it being you versus you. Instead of just trying to stay focused and better yourself. You know what I'm saying? You know? And that's how mugs out here putting these limits and putting these ceilings over themselves. And then guess what, bro? They get, they get to that little point that they got to and then think that that's a wrap. Think it's over. Yeah, yeah, we in, man. Listen, bro, you ain't done nothing. You know what I mean? You ain't done more. You ain't done half of what you could have did if your mind was right. You know what I'm saying? You ain't did half of what you could have did if your mind was right. So that's why we got to just stay focused out here, man. Understand what De Niro is saying, man. We got to be calm, you know, when we up. 
You know what I'm saying? We got to stay focused when we up. It's easy, you know what I'm saying, to, you know, give in to them voices that you be hearing, you know, that ego that you be hearing, you know what I'm saying? It's easy, to, it's easy to fall into that trap. So that's why you got to stay focused and understand, like, listen, nah, this is just a... It's just a positive step. I'm not telling you to not be proud of yourself. You know what I'm saying? I'm not telling you to not be grateful. You know what I'm saying? I'm not telling you that you can't, you know, celebrate your success and all of that. But understand, man, listen, you got to stay locked in at the same time. You know, don't go, don't go, don't go too, you know, don't, don't put too much energy into that, man. Continue to put your energy into the right things. Continue to put your energy into your purpose continue to put your energy into getting better <clears throat> you know what i'm saying it's like when kobe used to yell at some of them teammates that'll be just celebrating because they won a playoffs you know what i'm saying they won a playoff game you know what i'm saying mugs would be celebrating tom brady did the same thing had mugs crying you know on the tampa bay squad just because they had won uh the nfc championship and tom like what the heck you crying for bro well, this ain't it this is not it. What is you crying for? This this is not the big one. We didn't win. We ain't come home with the steal yet. We ain't come home with the trophy yet. We ain't come home with that yet. What is you crying for, man? Tom Brady, he got he got in a couple guys' ass, man. You know what I'm saying? But that'll be that's like you. That's like you know, like some of these mugs out here, man. You know, celebrating all like you know, like it's over, bro. It ain't over. It's just the beginning. So you gotta have that mindset when you up, bro. It's just the beginning. All right. And that's my word, man. My name, Jason. The Sin Take. Holla at y'all later, man. Peace.